We're at the York City Wastewater Treatment Plant in York, Pennsylvania. Our treatment plant has a design flow of 26 million gallons a day. We treat wastewater from seven municipalities, including the city of York and, and the surrounding municipalities. Currently, my energy bills run about $63,000 a month. To me, that's unacceptable. What we need to do is reduce that cost. We felt that by going with the capstone microturbine, we can do that. The microturbines produce 40% more power using the same amount of natural gas as my internal combustion engines. That's incredible. We were one of the first treatment plants back 20 some years ago to have a cogen system installed. We utilize our methane gas that we produce on site here with our internal combustion engines to produce about 20% of our power needs. The first five years there were very little maintenance costs, but as time has gone on, and technology has changed and those engines have aged, they've pretty much become a muddy pit for us. Every 700 hours, we need to do an oil change. That involved two mechanics, pretty much a whole day. It also involved using 110 gallons of oil. What we really needed was uh, a new technology, uh, a more efficient technology in order to generate electricity. One of the options was that we would reuse or uh, refurbish the existing reciprocating engines. Uh, but when we were looking at that as an option, we determined that uh, A, it wasn't cost effective. B, we were reaching back in technology instead of looking forward to new technology. Uh, we wanted to look for an opportunity to invest in future infrastructure development, not look to the past. And that's why we went with the microturbines. Through the evaluation, it was determined that the capital costs, the upfront costs, were not that much difference between the engines versus the microturbines. But when we looked at the, the overall picture, the life cycle costs, the microturbine technology came out better because it has higher efficiency. We went through a deliberate selection process when we, when we chose Capstone. Um, Capstone came to us uh, with a proven reputation. I think that was very important to us. The capstone turbine had some advantages over other manufacturers' turbines, one being that there was no liquid uh, lubricant in the system at all. It was all air-cooled, air-lubricated, very low maintenance costs. The only thing that we routinely need to check is an air filter, and that's it. This is a unique configuration where you've got a C600 and a C1000 aligned together uh, for an application. We're able to run our electric grid uh, two ways. We can either run it through methane recovery, that's the methane that comes off the digestion process, or we can run it off of natural gas. Why was that important to the authority? Uh, we needed redundancy. A methane recovery is absolutely paramount to us. We've got a renewable source of energy right here in the digestion process. Well, it's important because we need to you know, continually warm the digesters. And what we do is we put the hot water back into the digesters and that allows more gas to be produced and the turbines to run. The turbines run, they make baseload electricity 24-7 and then the hot water again is reused in the digesters. The other thing is that people don't think about at a wastewater treatment plant is we also have the air to deal with. These microturbines uh, emit so much less air pollution than the engines that we currently run to the point where I may not even have to report to the agency, the DEP, the amount of pollutants. It's going to be negligible. I am confident that if I need to reach out to Capstone, if I need to reach out to Efinity, they're going to be there for us. They're going to be standing beside us to assist us through the process.